This one is called, I Would Not Vote For You, Joe Biden. <laughs> <laughs> I would not vote for you, Joe Biden. I still don't know what you were hiding, or even what color horse you're riding. I'll print you a picture that makes you think back in cyan, magenta, yellow, and black. You hide behind Barack Obama as if he really were your mama. But you do not sing like Wilson Pickett. You were the counterweight on the ticket. You pretend to be liberal. But in reality, you voted with Republicans to trash Social Security. Though some forget, we are aware of credit card companies from Delaware that bring us debt without a limit who bought an office and put you in it. And now you are in Iowa with people asking, Iowa? <laughs> and things are getting mighty raucous as we begin our party caucus. Straw poles at the high school dance the last time that we took that chance. He couldn't keep it in his pants. <laughs> I won't vote for you in the gym or not in any state you're in. I won't vote for you in the park. I won't vote for you after dark. I won't vote for you in the sun. I won't vote for you on the run. I won't vote for you anywhere, not even if you're over there. The truth is that, despite the tokens, the Democratic Party's broken. It's hit an iceberg like the Titanic. When Bloomberg entered, I began to panic. He flooded the airwaves with TV ads from California to Islamabad. <laughs> While part of me thinks he's not so bad, the other part thinks I've just been had. <laughs> Eat gads. When at the polls they stop and frisk, I don't think I will take that risk. Mm. Or is it like the ship Poseidon steered upside down by old Joe Biden? <laughs> Are we all just rearranging chairs before they tumble down the stairs? <laughs> Do we get our news from Hollywood squares while searching for someone who cares? You may think that everyone's flirting with activities behind the Iron Curtain. What your son did in the Ukraine, some may think was a sin. But Hunter is a punter who just wanted to cash in. I know you point to Orange Nero, who in the mirror sees a hero. With MAGA hats and privilege born, rips through the land and leaves it torn. But before you lead us off a cliff, I'd rather vote for Adam Schiff. <laughs> <laughs> Republicans and Democrats both think they are such smarties, they've locked it down and fixed the game, so there are only two parties. Super delegates change the game. They all just want more of the same. The ballot boxes in the attic tell me it's not so democratic. When outsiders must win 60-40 and insiders just need Uncle Morty oh, to make his moves on election night to make the numbers turn out right. Pundits shout, too close to call. Outsiders shout, Rigo Ball. <laughs> now, I don't mean to sound obsessive. It's only that I think progressive. And though my lines are rather loose, I owe it all to Dr. Seuss. <laughs> but I would not read you my Seuss run. I would not read it just for fun. Not even if it had a pun about a $1 hot dog on a bun. Uh -huh. I could go on. But wait a minute. There are 51 criminals in the Senate. And if there are ways you don't eschew, perhaps you will make 52. Thank mm -hmm.